Okay, what's up? What's up you guys? Welcome back to another video. I am going to flip my screen down so I don't look at it. I want to look at you guys. Um, bad news, bad news. I'm going to let you in on a secret. <clears throat> this is the beauty. This is my, uh, well actually now I've got a fucking, oh yeah, still focused. Um, this is my Canon 80D. I've had it for over three years. It's an absolute beast. It's been around the world with me and it's been what has shot every single one of my reaction videos every single one can you believe it and uh <clears throat> lo and behold i i did the unthinkable and i actually broke it by accident so that is how it's looking at the moment um i probably could still use it but i don't think i don't think i can see anything well i certainly can't i can't can't use the, the autofocus or anything so basically this is obsolete right now not for photography, but I don't use it for photography. I use it for reaction videos. So I'm going to have to get that repaired. But what I've done in the meantime is buy another camera. Luckily, I didn't actually buy it for this purpose, but I'm going to use it for this purpose. The camera you're watching me on right now is a Canon 80, no, a Canon, uh, Canon G7X Mark III. It's the latest vlogging camera from Canon, and we're about to find out exactly how good the audio is because. Currently, I don't have a external mic on this camera. The audio you've heard so far has been on the external mic that's used with that camera. And that mic looks like this. So, nothing big. It sits on the top. But another thing that's broken is the little uh, holder. So, basically, I've got an obsolete microphone and an obsolete camera. And, uh, well, what I don't have is caffeine in the system. So I'm going to pour this, and uh, while I do, I'm going to have a look at the, the screen. 94, Jason Kelsey. Well, all right then. I know Travis Kelsey, and I know Jason Kelsey, but I, I can't remember much. So he's, uh, he's I, I feel like he was higher on the list last year, but we're about to find out, guys. Thanks for tuning in. Um, let's have a look at the 94th best player in the NFL for 2020, as voted by his peers, Jason Kelsey. Let's go. Okay, I've been working like three jobs. Probably why I never see ya. Probably why I never have time for the fake friends. I won't be ya. Oh God, I've been running now. Another person who I feel like is obviously. Uh... Um, he's known for being talented, but uh, Kels, the center from uh, the Eagles. Oh, Kels. The fastest center I've ever played against. So if you're playing against a center, you must be a safety? <clears throat> 72 last year. What are you doing, mate? Jason Kelsey's season ended in the Super Bowl. Watching his brother add a second Lombardi to the family collection. But only one of the Kelsey Oh mate, how good, good is it? Team. How good is it having two brothers in the league? They're actually at the top of their game. Great time. All pro in 2019. The center out of Cincinnati was the only Eagle to play every snap this past season. And that's a good thing, since the Eagles are 3-14 and 14 Every snap. He doesn't take a majority of the snaps. Ah, 3 and 3-14 without him. Jason Stay on there, man. He's just one of those dudes who might not be the most big guy. I was just going to say, he doesn't... I can't remember exactly how big he is. He might even be smaller than his brother, who plays tight end. He probably is. <laughs> I don't know about weight, but certainly height. But he plays like a big dude. He plays your stout and his <laughs> speed is remarkable. There's some plays where it'll be like a screen play or a hitch or something to the receiver on oh, the you know, past the numbers and you'll see him running out there to block. You know when a center's that fast because I feel like centers sometimes are... Hang on. Hang on. Stout and his you don't normally see you don't normally see centers um, head down the field like that, do you? Certainly not at that pace. Speed is remarkable. Where is he? 
there's some plays where it'll be like shifts to the right. Or, okay, you got the two blockers. One takes him. Oh. What happened there? There's some plays where Did that, like a that first or block wasn't into the receiver on the, you know. Well, he's got. Well, there's two blockers there for a reason, isn't it? Past the numbers, and you'll see him running out there to block. Certainly fast. The Certainly gets to a spot um, quickly. Um, they're in the middle of everything, so they don't really reach, you know, gets people, or you know, they usually get bumped. So when the center's blocking you, and especially me. Oh, look at that! Kind of nervous. Where's he coming from? Mate, he, he, I think he covered 20 yards in about two seconds flat. So when the center's blocking you, okay, leave him. Me, Go for this fella. Kind of Where's he coming from? Oh fuck yeah! Oh, <laughs> big hit. His ability to get on the second level and Travis Kelsey, the center for the Eagles. Understanding where the play is heading. Oh. <laughs> How it can unfold and position himself to. Who is that? He is shifty. Don't worry about Kelsey. Look at the running back. Kelsey's as consistent as they come, leading all centers with 89 consecutive starts. I think the big thing I can describe to Jason is that he makes it look effortless sometimes. There's really difficult blocks, and it could be frustrating as another center to watch it. You know, a guy has a whole full head of steam, and he just kind of gets his hands, anchors down, and that's where you know, the battle stops. You ain't going nowhere. Oh, look at that. Talks about the tough Fires it back across. He brings to the game and, um, for the touchdown. He's just uh, ultimately in that. Uh, and in a normal setting, uh, when you, well, especially when you're looking at it from the side, you would not have seen that battle going on between the two centers. Unless you're a lineman or a center out there, you would be looking at that. But I'm looking at the running back. I'm looking at the throw. I'm looking at the, the finish. And all that stuff that goes on in the middle. It's just lost. Unfortunately, it's lost. It's it's a tragedy. It really is. But but it's not lost on these guys. Locker room. Following the season, Kelsey was snubbed in the selection of the All Decade team. His three first team All Pro were more than Alex Mack and Marquise Pouncey combined. The former sixth round pick will no doubt use the slight to drive him moving forward. Nice. Hungry dogs oh. run fast. That's right. <laughs> I remember him. Um, all right, Travis Kelsey. You got man. Take a shot to A Rob. You got A Rob one on one. A Rob, Allen Robinson, wide receiver for the Bears. He's the next player. But first of all, I just want to check. Not Travis. Was it Travis? No. Zach. No. Jason. Jason Kelsey. I just want to check his height. Um, compared to his brother, actually. That's that's the that's the thinking around this. He is 33 years of age. He's just turned 33, November the 5th. Six foot three, uh, 295 pounds, almost hitting the old uh, the old 300. Pick 191, round number six of the 2011 draft to the Eagles, and he's still there. He's won one Super Bowl, uh, Pro Bowl in 14, 16, and 19, as we saw, and um, he just missed out in the All Decade team, as we just heard, unfortunately. So now I'm going to go to Travis Kelsey. And see what his size is like. Imagine these two brothers fucking getting in the fisticuffs. Um, six foot five, two sixty. He's got a bit of weight. Got a bit of weight to uh, catch up, but he's he's got the height, and that is what we call genetics. So I haven't taken a sip of this yet. I really need it. I'm fucking tired right now, but this has got to be done. I don't. I woke up this morning, man. I thought, fuck, my camera's broken. Ah, what am I gonna do? And you just got to do it. I mean, that's the advice that I give to anyone, you know, starting YouTube. Um, just keep uploading. Doesn't matter about the quality. Well, it does to a certain extent. But if you can get HD, you can create YouTube videos. So I'd have to say, as the great Casey Neistat said to me many years ago, just keep uploading. And I'll see you in the next one.